In this video, I'll teach you how to make some nifty back-to-back -back teaspoon setups. But before we get to that, let's talk about the Tetris randomizer. Do you remember those awful days where you'd be waiting forever and ever for that one line piece to come? In modern Tetris games like Puyo Puyo Tetris, that suffering is no more. Puyo Puyo Tetris uses a 7-bag randomizer that guarantees you'll get one of each Tetramino every 7 pieces, although not necessarily in any specific order. Still, the 7-bag system helps you plan ahead a lot, which means you can open matches with super strong attacks and keep the pressure on with back-to-back -back teaspoons. Since your first 7 pieces will consist of one of each Tetramino, there's actually a lot of ways you can start off the match with a teaspoon double. If your eye tetramino comes early, you can make this popular pattern called TKI3. It's a teaspoon double form that tends to lead into a lot more teaspoons. This is an air teaspoon double called Albatross. This form is good if you get an O and a J or L early. You start off with a teaspoon double, and it can easily lead into a teaspoon triple. Then you can squeeze out another teaspoon double. And if you're a bit lucky, you might even get a perfect clear. This pattern here is called Double Triple Cannon, or DT Cannon for short. There's a lot more ways to make it than I'm showing here, but here's the general shape. Kick the T Tetramino into the hole and rotate again for a T spin double. Then, Spin another T Tetramino in for the T Spin Triple. Here's another T Spin opener called Pelican. This one's useful if both the Z and S Tetraminos come early. Well, that's pretty much the extent of the T-spin openers I've practiced. There's many more openers you can learn from watching some actual professional Tetris players, but I think that's enough to get you started. Now, let's look at some mid-game back-to-back setups. A decent way to do some good burst damage is by attacking with a T-spin, followed up immediately with a Tetris. It's clean and pretty intuitive to make. This here is a special T-spin setup called the Super T-spin Double. Spin one t tetramino in for a T-spin Double, and you'll have another T-spin Double automatically prepared. Finally, I'll show you a cool form called Imperial Cross. You need an overhang for this one too. Kick the piece in and rotate twice for a T-spin Double, and that will set up for another T-spin Double. T-spin setups let you start the match strong and help you keep the pressure on. Make sure to practice them a lot 